introduce you to everybody that's up here on the stage. We have Mayor-elect Keith James. We have Commissioner Christina Lambert. Commissioner Corey Neary. Commissioner-elect Joe Peduzzi. And of course, we have Leah Rockwell, the Director of Parks and Recreation. And of course, we have your mayor, Jerry Moyo. We have booked about 832 bands in your eight years who have played more than 2,500 hours of music. I didn't drill that down to the minute, but that's, that's a lot of bands. We have shown more than 100 movies at Screen on the Green. There have been more than 2,880 Sandy Light music shows. That's a lot of music shows. The West Palm Beach Green Market was named the best farmer's market in Florida and one of the top 50 in the USA by Cooking Light Magazine during your term. Holiday Sand Tree was born during the tenure of Mayor Jerry Moya. So that would make you Sandy's mommy. <laughs> to thank her for her support. It says, thank you for eight great years. And we can all agree to thank me. Well, hello, West Palm Beach. Let's give a great big round of applause for our Parks and Recreation and Events Department. It's amazing what they have accomplished. I'm so happy to be here with you today. I have like four pages of speech, but I'm not gonna read it. <laughs> I'm, I'm really here tonight to say a very special thank you to each and every one of you. It's so, um, so neat to be here on the Clematis by Night stage, really for the last time as mayor, but that doesn't mean it's my last time at Clematis by Night, because I will definitely be here and to have this opportunity to thank you um, for allowing me the privilege of a lifetime. I want to congratulate him on his election and wish him the very best. And I want you, with a round of applause, to show him how you're going to support him through the next year, four, four to eight years. We're so excited that so many younger people are choosing to live in our city. Um, and we have just seen some wonderful streetscapes, great things happening in our parks. We're, we're about to cut a ribbon on a new water plant, and I could go on and on and on. But I want to say that none of that, none of that is accomplished alone. The only way we get things like that done is through the hard work of the 1,600 employees who work for the city of West Palm. We come to work every day, working to make this city a place where people want to be. We want to make this city a world-class city. We want it to be a place where people want to live, where people want to work, where people want to play. And that's what we've been working so hard for over the last eight I years. I was able to be mayor after only living here for nine years is because this community is such a warm and open and welcoming community. Um, you embrace people from all over, you make people feel welcome, and you su you've, support you've supported me and supported others. So thank you to the community of West Palm Beach.